I want to follow up on something I said about no labels yesterday. While I am convinced that if no labels runs a Joe Manchin or a Joe Manchin-like candidate, it will likely help Donald Trump, there also is something fundamentally just lazy about the way no labels thinks about American politics. No labels theory of American politics is that Donald Trump is on the far right, which is an interesting way to see Donald Trump. Donald Trump is a fascist, but he's not a far right ideologue the way, say, Ron DeSantis is or Ronald Reagan was. And that Joe Biden is on the far left. That is political fantasy. Joe Biden is an old center left, maybe centrist politician. But implicit in that notion is that we're going to put someone in the middle and they'll get the majority of the votes. And to believe that is to believe that the American electorate, the American voters, are distributed on something of a bell curve from left to right. And if you start, starting your understanding of American politics there is like starting your understanding of astronomy with the notion that the sun revolves around the earth. If you start either of those analyses with those assumptions, you're going to get to some very wrong conclusions. The American electorate cannot be described as existing on simply a left to right bell curve. That is a fantasy of pundits, lazy academics, and analysts, and it's simply not true.